Dominic Carl Manalo Rock, born July 20, 1990, is a Filipino actor and model. He is known for his role in Ariana and May I Sang Peng Arap. He is managed by ABS-CBN star Magic Talents. Early Life and Education Dominic Carl Manalo Rock or Dominic Rock was born and raised in the province of Cavita, Philippines. He is the son of businessman and a company president. He is also a nephew of actress Beth Tamayo. He attended high school in Imus Institute, Badge 2007. College in the La Salle College of St. Benilda and took tourism course. Career Modeling Dominic began modeling and endorsing several companies before heading into acting. He was a model for Cosmopolitan Talents since 2008, where he modeled the Philippine clothing brand, Pens Hoppy. Acting In 2010, Rock debuted on screen in the soap opera Abang Mabuay playing Mark. He later took his first major role in the fantasy drama series, Ariana in 2012. He played the character Hubert, wherein he CO starred and was paired with Ella Cruz. While taping the series, he did several guesting roles including Bandala and in the morning talk show Chris TV in which he spoke about issues relating to Catherine Bernardo. After Ariana ended in January 2013, he signed his second major role in the noontime drama series May I Sang Peng Arap where he played the arrogant Alvin. He was paired with Erin Ocampo, an up-and-coming female actress. In June 2013, Rock had his movie debut in the film Pag, an MMFF entry for 2013. He CEO starred with Daniel Padilla and Catherine Bernardo. In December 25, 2016, Rock starred as Fabian in a horror thriller film entitled Seclusion, which was an entry to the 2016 Metro Manila Film Festival. The film received a total of eight awards, the highest number awarded to a film in the competition. Curious to know more about Dominic? Here are some fast facts about him below. He's part of the celeb barricade called the Angaya Squad, they're all foodies, with Kath Neal, R.I.A. Atady, Gabi Garcia, and Calil Ramos, to name a few. He's super close with Judy Ann Santos and Ryan Agonzalo's fam that he considers their children his siblings. FYI, Judy Ann and his Tita Beth are BFFs. One look on his Insta feed, you'll know he absolutely loves riding his motorcycles. He's also really good at race car driving. He placed first place at the celebrity division of the Toyota Vios Cup Season 4 in 2017. Curious to watch some of his work online? You can catch him in the 2017 Liz Quinn rom-com My X and Y's which is available on Netflix and I want. And lastly, his hobby is taking photos of his close friends and loved ones. Beth Tamayo revealed details about the relationship of grandson Dominic Rock and BEA Alonso, they are happy. Beth Tamayo confirmed that she has been updated about her grandson Dominic Rock's love life. In fact, Beth said she had a lot of advice for Dominic, who is currently paired with actress BEA Alonso. Although Beth did not directly confirm the rumored relationship between Dominic and BEA, it was clear from the former actress's statements that there was a special reconciliation between the two. Beth's sister is Dominic's father. Between marine and domestic details. On March 7, Pep Troika interviewed Beth and her husband Adam Hutchinson through Zoom. Beth married Adam on March 3. Beth and her husband are based in Bay Area, San Francisco, California. At one point during the interview, Beth was asked if she had an update on Dominic's love life. Yes, the former actress calmly replied. Beth's response made a lot of sense when asked if she was happy for her nephew. Yes. BEA congratulated me on INSTagram when I posted the wedding. I said thank you. I'm happy, I'm happy for them. Beth told Dominic, as long as he's happy, I'll be happy. Despite news of their relationship, BEA and Dominic have yet to directly confess. Beth was impressed by her nephew and B's silence about whatever was happening between them. Beth said, for me, I think that's the mature way to handle it. Let. I mean, I think they're very, very confident and they're happy wherever they are in a relationship, wherever they are, and that's okay. As long as you don't admit to anything, you won't deny anything. Beth's next statement is known. She said, if you can be seen together, eh, you can't be seen together, can't you? If your photos in a man polo are separate, well, your photo in a man polo is separate. In February, BEA and Dominic's social media posts failed to escape the observant netizens, suggesting that they were together in a man polo, Palawan. Before that, they also had pictures showing them traveling together in other places, such as Japan and Baguio. Between domestic recommendation about relationship with BEA, 
Beth also mentions the love advice she gave Dominic regarding his relationship with BEA. She said she advised her nephew to be quiet in his love life. She also reminded the actor of what others could say about his relationship with BEA, an A-list celebrity. Beth said, I also told Dominic that he was going to get a lot, like, you know, because BEA is the bigger star, right? I said to him, maybe later on, you'll get a backlash from people who say having a hand in B's popularity or whatever. Like, you don't have an identity of your own, or something that just likes to write in his career, something like that. It's not that easy. But Beth's advice to Dominic is, let it go. I told him, you can get, for example, some bad feedback from others, just hate it, because you know what you're doing and where you're happy to. Because you can't avoid it, e. There are and there are people who will say bad things about them or him, who are not conducive to the relationship. Beth says she's very happy that Dominic is open to her, and she sees that he's happy now. But, he's good. In fact, I appreciate him. DOM is always texting me and texting me about him and what's new. Sometimes there is a picture with me. He will send a photo, said Beth, 